question of like, you've been wrestling with this, you've been thinking about it, and what you've recently been saying to me is that you want to bring together your psychiatric knowledge with your other passions and love for other things, you say what they are, um, and just talk about how you're imagining bringing those things together and serving the community in a way that you can't do in a structured job. I mean, you know, so kind of tying see, in. See, I do this shit to everybody, not just you guys. <laughs> I ask hard questions. <laughs> Ty, tying into hip hop, right, about, you know, how do people survive? Um, you know, and, and some people have different strengths. So how does that get turned into a community? And hip hop, was all when it began, it was all about community, right? How did hip hop start? Well, yeah, how did hip hop start, right? There's different origin stories. But one of the, like, you know, the more famous ones was just getting people together for a back to school party. And somebody just sampling music and everybody in the neighborhood in the Bronx um, is there to celebrate together, right? So how do you build on your strengths? And each person recognizes what they can do. You got your breakers, you got your spitters, you got your dancers, you got your rappers, you got your DJs. And how do you build on those strengths? And sometimes you, you don't know when everything feels overwhelming, right? Where do you start solving the problem? Kind of tying it to your interests. And so my interests are arts, my interests are music, dance, and mental health. And hip hop is a good platform to start that with because tying that to arts and free form creative expression is a really good way to start, especially for kids here. So thinking about that in terms of you know, hip hop initiatives. Yeah. So, so what would, so what would like, a hip hop wellness institute look like? You want people who have a, an outlet that where there might not necessarily be one in the formal aspects of schools in a supportive way, <coughs> which is tricky because hip hop as a whole in Madison hasn't been had the most welcome stay. There's a scene, but it seems to be a struggling scene. Um, and if you want more arts expression, you probably need a space to be able to do it freely with people who can pass down their own skills. So anybody who's a spitter, anybody who's a dancer, anybody who's all about kind of mindfulness and wellness, how do, how do people have a space to be on their own to express themselves and to learn kind of the peace, the love, the unity, and the fun of hip hop? Yeah, 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 yeah. So we can really, so we can really foreground that fun element. Um, okay, I got one other question. Did anybody, you guys have, I'm gonna ask my final question, but anybody have like a question there they really wanna ask Teddy? Go ahead, Jeff. Did you spit bars? No, I don't spit. <laughs> what, what class, I'm gonna I'm I'm teach the rhyme, and what are you gonna teach? Dance. Okay. And mindfulness. And mindfulness, all right? Okay, so guys, remember I said, so I have, you. my question for you guys, you know, it's gonna be written, it's gonna be on Canvas, you're gonna get it, but I told you that, like, I have these questions for Teddy, and a lot of this stuff she's already told me, um, but I did also say that there are, you know, that there's some questions that I don't have, even I don't have answers to, right? So that's why we dialectically do these things. And that's why I have to ask you. And, uh, but I love your vision. Um, I knew that you, I felt that you had the vision, I tested you out early on, you know, with bringing you to places that are, you know? So, um, so really, so this is, this is what I wanna ask. Um, you and you also talked about like, you know, thinking about these things, and like, I've talked about the prophet that you the hip hop generation, transgenerational, right? We're really about social justice, we're about this long term. So, um, you know, I showed you, I told you the theme is the ethic of love. And uh, y'all know what my question is, right? You guys know? You know. You know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs>
Yes, sir. Give it up. Give it up for yourselves, ladies and gentlemen. Amen. Okay, so, uh, so you know where to find me. You know, I'm in the streets, you know, you know where it is. If you want to get down with the Hip Hop Wellness Institute, you know who to go see. If you got psychological issues, you know who to go see. If I give you psychological issues, you know. Yeah, sure, you have some more. Let's make